Well, hello there, you wonderful humans, and welcome to PAL World. And thank you to the developers of the game for providing me with early access to be able to play a couple days early for all of you. I've uh, been really excited about this one. A couple people have been streaming it over the past couple days. Looks surprisingly good. This is an open world survival game with um, creature collecting or monster collecting parts of it. Um, looks really, really good. So it's an open world survival and crafting game. Uh, we're going to jump right into that. Uh, we're going to create a new world. Now, once the game officially releases, I will be hosting a 32 player world, probably multiple of them for those that, uh, that want to be able to play along. TV, pal time, fun time. Perfect. So there we go. Confirm. It's the perfect name. Uh, multiplayer. We're going to turn that on. We're going to have an invite code. Which we'll be able to do. We're going to have no... Ooh, there's different difficulties. Interesting. Uh, we're going to start with normal. There's also a custom difficulty, which is pretty cool. But we're just going to go ahead and pop right in. Now, once the game is fully released, we will be able to play with up to 32 other people. Which is really exciting. Um, we got tag. We're just going to go with tag. tag delicious. There we go. Confirm. Confirm. And let's see. We got presets. What do we got here? Look at Big Hair McFancy Pants. You know what? I kind of like this guy. We're going to start with this one. We're going to keep the same body. We're going to maybe change the face a little bit. Actually, you know what? The face is pretty fire right now because uh, because we want that beard. We just want to change the eyes a little bit. There we go. Then we can change the eye color. We'll change that to blue. And wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. I think we are good to go. I like the hair. Ooh, we do have some different hair options. Oh, there we go. Now, now we're straight killing it. Preston, thank you for the 30 months. Character creation complete. You cannot edit your character after this. Let's hop right in. Nice eight pack there. Oh yeah. Are these our starters? Can't wait to see Tag play Pokemon Rambo. Oh my God. The towers are the key. The tree holds the truth. All right, so we've already got some uh, some Breath of the Wild vibes. Look, it's not about the story with these games, right? So we got to pick up fallen branches or hit trees to get some wood. <laughs> oh no, that sounds just like Breath of the Wild. All right. Uh, open the options menu with escape to check the survival guide, and then we'll hit B to open up the primitive workbench and select a wood. Okay, so we got to build that somewhere. Let's pick up some fallen branches. Tag living his hair dream. Again, look, if I can't have hair in real life, I'm going to get it somewhere. Look at that. We got a, a, a chickpea. Who is this? Hello, stranger. Stranger danger. Oh, God. Just whipping out a gun. Expedition survivor. A castaway. Been a while since someone who didn't stink of pals washed up here. This island is a living hell. People I came with aren't with us any longer. Those darn pals ate every one of them. You be careful out there. Here, take some basic supplies. We need to toughen up. We got some wood. Beat that chicken? It's gone. Hold on. Can we touch this little tower thing right here? Ooh, we got fast travel, and we got a technology point. Very nice. All right, we're going to go spank a chicken real quick. See what that do. Oh, no, I'm not going to beat you. I will spank you, though. Is there a punch? Yeah. Oh, snap. Ah! Oh, man, it freaking hits hard. Yeah. Take it, take it, take it. Dirty little chicken. I will spank you into oblivion. Ooh, we got poultry and an egg. <laughs> nice. We did take a little bit of damage there. What do we get from the cat boy? Nice. We got little stun effects, which is nice. The cat, way, way worse than the chicken. We got red berries from the cat. Genshin meets Pokemon. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, look, it's not dead. It's just stunned. We have unused stat points. 
Open the options menu to check the survival guides. We got PAL deck. Technology, so we can get all of these. We got a PAL box. Oh, a PAL sphere. We definitely want to unlock that. We got campfire. Let's unlock these first. How many points we got? We got a couple of them. A wooden chest seems pretty useful. Repair bench. Ooh, wooden structure set. Let's make that. Perfect. Can you catch it? If I could craft those uh, those Pokeballs, essentially, we would be able to. Uh, so inventory one. We want to make our first like a little building bench. Let's see if we can find a little place to live, and then uh, and then we'll work on building out our first bench and trying to catch our first pals. I had no idea we were live. Didn't get the notification. Oh, you know what? I need to post this on Discord. Because uh, we do have early access to this, which I've been incredibly excited for. And thank you to everybody coming to hang out today. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. We will be playing with members on a server once it's released. Uh, at everyone. Playing Pal World. World. Let's go. Boom. Get the chat back up. A little late, but here. Got meat from a still living animal. Savage. All right, so these are collectible rocks. Uh, everything I've seen so far looks like the game's going to be really good. Uh, right now, we have 32 player servers. There is no PvP currently. Um, but PvP will be available in the future, which is going to be pretty interesting. You can set up pals to, like, do base defense and things like that. So, it should be a very interesting time. How do I get off this god dang mountain without dying? Uh, open the options menu. Check the survival guide. Survival guide. Controls. Level up. Pal box. How's it part? Well, there's so much. We have Sanity. When pals do work at a base, their sanity drops. As their sanity drops, they will slack off or maybe even get sick. If a pal's hunger level is low, their sanity will drop more easily. If pals quality food uh, or let them rest in a hot spring to recover their sanity. Okay. Press B. Craft a pal sphere. Attack pals to weaken them. Press Q to throw a pal sphere to capture them. All right, let's just go ahead and, and build one of these primitive workbenches real quick. Uh, hold to build. Yeah, bonk it, baby. Carolina, thank you for the 44 months. Was hoping you'd stream this. Game looks great. It really does. All right, so we need a Paldium Fragment, wood and stone. So now we need to find a Paldium Fragment. When you ask your parents for Pokemon cards for Christmas and they get you Pal cards. <laughs> Look, Pal, Pokemon. Yeah. Pal cards could probably be cool. They have guns. Oh, thank you, Fearless. Appreciate you. And thank you again to the developers for giving me a early access keys. I also have two keys to give away today, too. So we will do that at some point during the stream, probably at the top of the hour. Um, we'll do a giveaway. I've got two keys to give away. Pokemon with pew pews. Yeah, we got to find the, the Paldium. I imagine it's some kind of, like, mining material. We got the fast travel point up there. Oh, there it is. Interesting. I think maybe I was just going the wrong direction. Did I get wood from punching a tree? I don't think I did. How do I... How do I acquire you? I'm gonna keep punching it. I don't think this is working, though. I feel like I need to mine it. Oh, nope, it's working. It's not working well, but it's working. Digimon had guns? That's true! Digimon did have guns. Man, Digimon were crazy. All right, let's see if we can... Let's make another primitive workbench here. Looks super pretty so far. I know nothing about this game, but I'm here to learn. Look, none of us really know anything about this game. I do need to blow my nose real quick, though. I'm still sick. And yes, the game does come out Friday. Um, I do have early access to it currently. So we need five stone to be able to make a pick. 
Yeah, the game officially releases on Friday the 19th. Uh, 32 player servers, which we will be hosting for members of the community. I don't think I'm getting anything from that. Can't wait for it to get it off Game Pass for my Legion. Yes, yeah, so it is on, uh, it's going to be available on Xbox Game Pass, which means if you have Game Pass, you can play it on Xbox or PC. It is also available through Steam. The codes I have to give away today are two codes for Steam. Apparently, Punching Trees does, in fact, give you some wood. $30, and it's also on Game Pass, yes. So if you've got Game Pass, you can essentially play it for free, which is pretty nice. I don't know if this is going to give us stone or metal, but I'm going to punch it. Oh, it gives us ore. Okay. I need to find stone. Fall damage, we'll find out soon, I bet. You know, there's probably fall damage. Ooh, there we go. Woo, my butt. My butt glowed. That's good news right there. Nothing like a glowy butt level up. Ooh, we got a free chest here right at the beginning. Needs a copper key. And we've got... Pick up a Castaway's Journal Day 2. Intriguing. All right, we need, I think, one more stone of some sort. Please be a stone. Thank you. I think we just needed six. Can tag set himself on fire. Look, there is fire in this game, and there are pals that do fire damage, so chances are pretty high of me lighting myself on fire. Oh, I gotta actually touch the bench. Interesting. Requires handiwork. <laughs> now we're ready to go. Oh yeah, that's way better damage. Beautiful. We're evolving. <gasps> Ten minutes and I'll be on fire. Chances are pretty high. I think we get a chicken as our first pal. They seem pretty. They seemed way more strong than the uh, than the cat boy for sure. <gasps> Speak of the devil and you shall receive chicken boys. Oh look at that freaking long neck McDingle face over there. It's like a flower dragon thing. There we go. I like that you can seemingly climb on like arc. Yeah. That's a thing. Alright, so a sphere we need stone. That looks like a stone pile right here. Tishy, thing for the 19 months. Time to catch some po I mean pals. Yeah. Like it's just a monster collecting game. Like Digimon or Pokemon or any of the other monster collecting games that have existed throughout time and space. But this one's an actual survival game, which is what I have always wanted Pokemon to end up being. Like, an open world, like, I don't know how there isn't a Pokemon MMO yet. Like, yeah, we have... I just, I just don't get it. So many missed opportunities. Alright, so let's make a Pal Sphere. We'll make a Kepalides. We'll make... We can make five of them. We can make ten of them. We can make five of them. There is Pokey MMO. That's not a real Pokemon game. It's very good, don't get me wrong. Uh, Pokey MMO is amazing, but there's no official Pokemon MMO. Alright, so we got a couple of those. We got a torch. I should probably make a stone axe. We need some wood. Can I axe some trees? Is this working? It is. You want some chicken? Where are you at? I freaking hear you. I will end you. Where are you at? Oh, I will catch. Where are you? Oh, it's a sheep. <laughs> That's a sheep sound. Kato! Pokemon Company really screwing up by not doing this already. 
and not with those bad graphics they keep trying to sell us on. Yeah. I mean, honestly, somebody new needs to take over the Pokemon IP, honestly. Like, it needs to be brought into the, uh, you know. A whole new world. Let's craft one of these. Base building, you say? I love base building. Yes, and your Pokemon or pals will actually help with the base building, too. So, um, you need them to work on your... Basically, they're doing all the things that we know Pokemon do in Pokemon games, but uh, it's actually evident here. You actually eat the pals. <laughs> uh, they'll work on your, your village or town or whatever you end up building. All sorts of stuff. Want to get some more of this ore. Our inventory is slowly filling up, though. Do we know if there's a story or plot? Um, I don't really know if there is a story and or a plot. Most open world crafting survival games don't have much of a story. I, have a, I do have a very thin neck, Umsta. Very strangely thin. Weapon is damaged. Okay, so we do have to repair our weapons and stuff. All right, let's stop crafting that ore. All right, let's go slap a chicken. A wooden club? I feel like that's... We should club a chicken like a baby seal. That seems like it's going to be pretty effective. Alright, wooden club. How do we uh how do we assign that to a uh to a spot? Oh, I did break my stone pickaxe. How does one repair? So we can equip, discard, we have enhanced stats. Where'd my club go? Oh, it's equipped here. Weapon. There we go. <laughs> Ooh, I have unused stat points, too. Technology. Definitely need that repair bench now. Can make a bow. Some arrows. A shoddy bed. Ooh, and out an armor. A straw pal bed. That seems pretty useful. Repair kit, probably pretty great. Alright, which one wants to get clubbed first? That cat's got a very sassy cat face. We're going to take the loner over here. It's going to be our new friend. Yeah, come here, buddy. You're going to be my best friend. Oh, God. Come back. Baby, come back. Stop. Oh, shoot. Did I miss? Yeah. Oh, God. Did I lose that forever? Attack pals to weaken them. Press Q to throw a pal sphere to cap... Yeah, I killed your friend. What you want? Do I do that? <gasps> oh, we gotta... We gotta stun it. Oh, what the heck? You want some of this? Big boy? Oh, shoot. All right. Third time's the charm. Oh, that one's level one. We need a level two. Bonk. Oh, you're level three? You a big boy. 68% chance. 85. Let's go. 99. Ooh, who's your daddy? All right, so we got one chicken boy. Yeah. Boom. He's an egg layer. Where are you going? Did I release you? Are you my friend now? What's going on here? I think I, I feel like I broke it. Get back here. Are you my friend or what? Love him? Alright, he's definitely my friend. Command pal, summon pal. Oh, pet. Who's a good chicken? Yeah, I'm sorry I clubbed you a little bit. This is just how we need to be friends. Come back here. 
All right, we got throw pal sphere, summon pal. We can command, oh, we can feed him. Command attack aggressively, focus on same enemy. There we go. All right. We gotta get some sweet levels. Yeah, let's pick on some cats. Bonk! Chicken boy, do something. Did he just... Oh, snap. Get him! <laughs> nice. Get him, chicken boy! What is it doing? Oh, snap. Oh, chicken boy's attacking all of the cats now. Hiya! Don't you touch my chicken like that. Yeah, who's a good chicken? <laughs> Danger! I don't know if we could be friends anymore if that's how you treat your friends. Look! It was mandatory! Level four, let's go. Ooh, three fragments, nice. Feeling pretty good right now. Uh, Kato, you're gonna be checking out the game. All right, so we can get our our pal spheres back that we lose. <gasps> There's a big rhino boy over here. I wonder if they're aggressive. All right, I'm assuming if we touch this button and feed, we can feed some berries. See, look, I'm a good friend. Who's a good chicken? Sometimes you have to smack a friend. Look, sometimes friends, they just, uh, they need a little bit of, uh, aggressive, uh, I don't know. I'm not having, I'm, my, my brain's not doing good brain stuff today. I like this axe does 69 damage, though. You are, comes out Friday, right? It sure does. It sure does. Ooh, shoot, we are thicker than a box of jelly donuts right now. So let's make another primitive workbench. We'll make a repair box too. Oh, I'm hungry. We need to make like a little fireplace or something. Yeah, aggressive encouragement, exactly. Oh, hello, big rhino boy. You're on the thumbnail. Oh my God, you're level 35? What are you doing out here? Nobody piss off that thing. Who's a good chicken? How do we enslave our chicken to do our work for us? Dude, no wonder we need to enslave pals. This is taking forever. <sighs> Repair. Did we do it? Yeah. Okay. All right, we got arrows. Should probably make a torch now that it's nighttime. I need a cat or a sheep to help me out. Well, we'll tame a cat. There we go. Maria, what's going on? Is there a way? I wish there's got to be a way to. Uh, we need to eat. I don't have a. We do have a campfire. How do we make it. Mm. I need. Oh God, said ten wood. Oh my god, a dinosaur. You a thick boy too. You're a grass and dragon type, huh? Mm -mm. Alright, build campfire. Let me start cooking our pal meat. I suck the chicken back into my body. 
Thick with two C's. Thick boy got a nice sway to his <laughs> walk. He does. Look at that thick old dragon donk right there. Dang. Oh, man. We got grilled <laughs> grilled chickpea. Oh, heck yeah. Boom. Oh, snap. Look at this. Those chickens didn't know what was coming to them. Oh, and our... Our bird's getting XP from this crafting, too. That's super cool. Yeah, it's Pokemon... It's, it's it's like if Ark, a Pokemon, and, like, Genshin Impact had a baby. Man, those were some fire-freaking-chef skills right there. Oh, it's a little sleeping food item. Oh, we're about to ruin its day. Oh. Inventory. I want to stick this food in my mouth hole. Where'd it go? Did I... I cooked it, right? Did I fail at cooking and not even notice? I feel like I did. Huh. I wish there was a better way to have, like, tools and stuff equipped. There's prob- there's gotta be a way. Can we, like, assign it to a button? Oh, snap. All right, let's get some food. I think it's tab to open the inventory quicker and you can cycle through tools. Yeah, we just gotta figure it out then. Oh, I have to claim it from the fireplace. Shoot. <gasps> we can make a fried egg and baked berries. Let's do that. Gonna work, 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 work. Mouse wheel is how you should be able to change weapons. That makes sense. I wish there was like a one, two, three, four, five. But I mean, otherwise, that's not bad. <clears throat> I need some clothes. Ooh, chicken boy leveled up. We need to make some more Pokeballs. We're going to tame a cat. And a Shep. Tab? Yeah, so tab does work. Okay. So we got different food items. Place food in the slot and both... Wait. And both player and active pals will automatically eat. Requires a giant feed bag and a small feed bag. Ah uh ha -huh ha -huh ha! -huh. Intriguing. So we do have to make sure we keep our things fed, including ourselves. And it is cold out there. Oh shoot! Need stone. Okay, so that does work to cycle through items. Okay, so I'm assuming if we just equip them on that, then we can cycle through it like this. There we go. You can have banquets in the Cult of the Lamb update. Oh, yeah, babies. <laughs> yeah, the Cult of the Lamb update looks really good. Probably won't be playing it, though. Sins of the Flesh update. We are thick. Oh, shoot. I can't walk. Uh, what do we need to drop here? I don't want to drop my expensive stuff. If I drop it, is it going to stay there? Beautiful. And then we're going to try and build a chest. We'll build a little storage box up here. Like, this is obviously not where we're going to live. But I feel like just having like a beginning base. God dang it, we need wood. Put 
put this right here. Also, ladies and gentlemen, if you do find yourselves enjoying the uh, the Pal World streams, make sure to slap that like button. Show the video some love. Let the YouTube algorithm know you want more. It helps out so much. Oh, so you can split a stack that way. Perfect. Okay. You know, we need to build the power box next. And we need to summon a pal to our base. B. Pal box. Capture five lamb balls and earn an XP bonus. I'm assuming the lambs are the ones that we're going to use as our initial workforce. Or chickpea. All right, let's go for... Ah, we can't really leave the base yet. Whoa, what's over there? Oh, that's the moon. <laughs> I'll just have to do it this way. Any word if there will be official public servers? It's going to be a solo hosted style game. I believe it's going to be um, solo and hosted. Um, there's a level three pal right there. There's a level one. What's this little blue circle thing? Is that our base? Yeah, level three, baby. Get him. Fifty-three. Come on, baby. Yeah. Let's go. Boom. Ooh, we got mutton and wool for that. I got early access? I did. Very exciting times. All right, which one he uses the higher level one? I want no low level sheeps. Wake up. Wake up. Oh, they be rolling. Oh, shoot. Oh, it's on fire. <laughs> this is a great weapon. Turns out lighting things on fire is great for catching. That worked out way too well. All right, we ain't getting no level ones. Mm-mm. You know what? Yeah, catch on fire. What you gonna do? Huh? What you got? That's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> Poor things. Burn, baby, burn. Lamb Inferno. Oh, we got little bird boys over here. What is this thing? Level 5 Hoocrates? That thing looks freaking cool. It's a little shadow thing. I feel like we're going to get clapped if we fight that thing. I'm going to... We're going to avoid that thing for now. Did you grab a ledge and then climb? Yeah, we did. You saw it. I don't know if those things are aggressive, but I feel like they would be. Look at the cute little duck boy. A pangolet. He's a little squirter ice Pokemon. You're gonna be my friend. I think there's friendly fire. Oh shoot, he's got butt icicles! Nice. Oh, dude, why are you going out and hunting all these pungal pangaloots? Oh, sh shoot! 
freaking butt icicles? What the heck? Get out of here. <gasps> it's a freaking Eevee? What? Come here. Come here. Oh, come here. Oh, shoot. What was that? Oh, oh, you can dodge? Get back here. <gasps> I murdered its face. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, god dang. Oh, chick be coming in freaking hot. Come here. And that thing clapped my cheeks. <gasps> oh, shoot. Oh, you want some of this? 94% baby. Yeah. Let's freaking go. We got our first Eevee. Compared to a Lamble, it has finer wool and temperament more suited for domestication. However, it has historically always been kept as a pet. Interesting. Don't do it, bird boy! I freaking saw you about to clap some cheeks. Make sure I collect the orange towers. Yeah, we'll make sure to do that. I believe I need to catch uh, Uno Mas Lamboy. You know what? Welcome to the community, Lamboy. Let's go. I feel like we should uh, we should move away from the entrance area. We'll we'll rebuild the things that we just got. We'll make another one. We got plenty of resources. Oh, Alyssa, sorry to hear you're stuck inside in the, from the freezing rain, but hopefully the family's staying nice and warm. Uh, but yes, we will be hosting uh, the 32-player servers. Uh, members will be able to join in and play along. Uh, eventually, the PvP will be released. I'm not exactly sure how that all is going to work, but um, it'll be interesting. Interesting to see what people will build, what kind of pals everybody will catch, what, what the favorites will be. We got a shiny little crystal thing over here. What's this? Yeah. A small a small pal soul. Oh, it gives the pals XP. That's cool. Look at that. Were they, were they just doing stretches over here? <gasps> it's an egg. What was it? I just steal somebody's baby? I'm a freaking baby thief? I gotta upgrade my base to make a second base? Oh lord. Alright, well at least we have unlocked fast travel. There's a little chest over here too. Alright, oh man, this map is... Why do I have so much of the map unlocked? The Plateau of Beginning! Oh, we can disassemble the PAL box. Um, perfect. That is actually really nice. That means we can just rebuild our base wherever we want. And I want to build it next to this nice little beach with a fast travel point nearby it. Because that seems like a big brain freaking PAL world thing to do. Which is exactly what we're going to do. I want there, there's, we got trees over there. CF Guardian, what's going on? So this is Tag's new ARC community? Exactly. Wait, the only way to save? Is to go back to the title screen? We're playing online, though. We're not playing solo. I feel like if we're playing online, that should we should save automatically. There's missions? All right, let's put some Lambles in here. Oh, shoot. We need one more Lamboy. You know what? We're going to catch a higher level. Nah, we'll keep that one. I don't know whether to play this or Enshrouded. Both. Enshrouded comes out this week as well. This is going to be a good week of open world survival games. I'm excited. I don't want to open. Yeah, we'll open it. 
What do we got in this little box? Gold coins and arrows. Hell yeah. So this first little box is li literally right here. So this is where you start. You come down this little road, and you got another little box right there. That's pretty nice. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Chicken boy, come back. Missing arc streams? Did I get burned on it? Um, I didn't necessarily get burned on it. I'm just waiting for uh, some of the... Some of the stabilization stuff to happen. We got the... Um, new maps coming out and honestly we just got so many other games that i've been needing to play as well i mean we played <gasps> ow how does get i need a freaking bow oh man can i get that i can get one of those at the beginning of the game little flappy boy look at that thing a nightwing level 10 female famale Plus, we got Pokemon Arc now. Nightwing hits hard. Yeah, I figured we're kind of low level for it, but... Get in the ball, boy. RG Addiction 2.0. Level 6, baby! What is this? Little... What, why is it shaking its butt like that? Bro, what's going on with you, homie? You got a big old jiggly booty. Come here. I'm gonna make you work at our at our house. Oh, make me club you like a baby freaking seal. What the heck? Yeah. Even pals twerk. A strange pal with a body resembling tree sap. It gradually loses strength if it has nothing to cover its body with, eventually rotting away. Well, that's kind of sad. All right, so we have fast travel unlocked. Do we just click it? How does that work? Or do we have to... I bet we have to go to a fast travel point to use a fast travel point, huh? What you gonna do with that pig pal butt? You're very conflicted about the world. Actually, I want to make sure that I'm actually playing on the highest quality. Presets. Epic. Um, we're going to play on... I guess performance? Balanced? Quality. There we go. Field of view. And we weren't even playing on the highest settings. Restart is required? No. We'll do that later. The game is twenty nine ninety nine. Yes, should get a fire pallet cooks for you. Yeah, if we find one, obviously I will do that. All right, lamb boy, how's at base? One lamb boy, but he's level two. Screw that. Where's the level three one? Level five. All right, you're gonna be our little worker, buddy. Current missions: build a wooden chest. Yeah. Son of a... Putting the wrong buttons. Insufficient materials. Yeah, there'll be two streams tonight. We'll probably do two of these. We got early access. We got to play, you know? Got to learn all the things. Ah, shoot. About to be thicker than a box of jelly donuts right now. All right, let's make a chest. Where do I want the chest to be? I kind of want it to be... We'll make it up here. All right. No worker assigned. How do we assign a worker? Oh, 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 get it, boy. Oh, hell yeah. Who's a good pal? Who's a good friend? 
That's pretty cool. I do gotta say, that's pretty nifty. Oh, dude bro's got like a little question mark on his head. We need some stone. It's a pal sweatshop. Look! It's no different than Pokemon. You know dang well all the Pokemon are doing all the work in the Pokemon world. We just don't we just don't highlight it as a thing. Oh, you got a stone for us too? What? You got like a little menu. I can lift you up. Come here. Oh yeah. We can we can even take this little work escort service. <laughs> Feed pet. We can add it to the party. That's cool. Okay, so we've got new technology to learn. Learn cloth. Ooh, a stone spear. We definitely want the cloth outfit. Ooh, a feed box. We have an alarm bell, a hanging trap, and a common shield. Repairs itself without taking damage. We've got a berry plantation, a ranch, normal parachute, a fire bow with fire arrows. A bell that sets alert status for pals on base. Chains pal behavior to either attack invading enemies or focus entirely on work whenever you like. A hanging trap. Berry plantation. A freaking ranch. A farm for raising sheep and fowl like pals. Assign a pal for the appropriate traits to a farm to automatically produce items. Parachute. Yes, I just want to learn all the things. Did a sheep with a hammer convince me to buy it? Look at the wood! It freaking puts stuff in your bot. That's so freaking cool. How awesome is that? It literally collects materials for you and puts it in your box. <gasps> you deserve all the food. You deserve all the food. Feed box. You know what? We're going to make you a nice little berry box right here, buddy. And we're going to fill it full of snacks. I'm even going to build it for you. Oh, we do it together? What the heck? Who's a... Oh, I'm gonna pet the bejesus out of you. Come back here. Who's a good sheep? Yeah. All right, let's stick some berries in here. Boop. We got berry seeds. I got a freaking soul. I can... <laughs> It can draw out hidden abilities off offered to a statue of power. What? Yeah, we'll make a bet at some point. We need to make a campfire. He's such a good boy. Can you make him a house? I'm gonna make him a house. Oh god, who's I, I wanna name you. We need to make food. A lamb kebab. Make a bed for the sheep. I will, I will. There's gotta be a way to name them. You need a bed to name it? Perfect. Okay, and we got some money. I don't know what that's. Pal fluids? I'm just stealing their fluids. That's a little weird. Alright, let's queue up a bunch of this cloth. A little pal boy will work on that. We definitely need some berries. We need a little berry plantation. We need wood. 
keep that tree alive. This makes you want to play Pokemon. Why would you want to play a more basic version of this? Play this. I kept seeing articles about this game and sort of ignored them, but now seeing it, I'm definitely grabbing this on Friday. Noise. You will get a mysterious person visit your base. You can use your money to buy things off of them. Okay. Very cool. Alright, one plantation. And one a nice flat spot. We'll put it right next to the berry thing. I feel like that's a good use of, of stuff. Make that last piece of cloth. Alright, we can make cloth armor. Ooh, nice. We're looking pretty good now. Tell you what. All right, so we need to make a bed. So we need a straw pal bed. I feel like we'll we'll put that bad boy right there. Planting and watering, interesting. Yeah, I don't I don't want to run around on a loincloth anymore. <laughs> Build up your base until it reaches level 7. Increase your pal level by capturing 30 pals. Man, seeding this takes forever. God. Yeah, get, get at least some water on there, buddy. <laughs> the little cat's getting chased by the gum boy. I'm curious how the whole base leveling up process goes. I'm assuming I have to go into the PAL deck to uh, figure out how we level up the base. Look, we're getting some of the water on the plantation, okay? We're not perfect by any means. Are the map layouts random? I actually do not know. I'm going to assume probably not. I didn't see any options for, like, seeds or anything like that. All right, so we have missions and we have fast travel. What, what missions we got? Build a wooden chest. Deploy a pal to work at the base. Base upgrade. Uh, build a shoddy bed. Oh, now we can have two pals out here. All right, so maybe we go tame a cat. Let's go tame a cat real quick. Uh, see what kind of good goods the kitty gives us for building. Those different types of pals will work on different things. So having an array of pals is going to be beneficial to us. Map layout is not random. Yeah, I didn't think so. This yeah. is my first... God dang it, bird boy. Get back in the ball. There we go. Alright, there's our first kitty. The penguin waters crops. Yeah, I figured. Water Pokemon, you know. Clap! Get him, chicken boy. Oh! You got him a little too good, buddy. You're a good chicken, but you, you're a little strong. I needed that cat. Ooh, chicken boy learned air cannon. What? Oh, God dang it. Get back in the ball. I'm so used to E being the button you use to collect stuff. He was so proud of himself, too. Yeah, he clapped that thing. There we go, there's another level four. 
Where you going, big boy? Why are you all moist? Oh, Jesus Christ! Want to kill your mom? Jesus! Go to sleep. <gasps> no! I'm out of Pokeballs! Oh, lamb boy! God dang it, I ran out of- ran out of Pokeballs. Oh, god dang it, Bobby. I can make two? Chicken flying out whenever you do something is funny. <laughs> it's always out to get me. Chicken boy, what you doing right now? You're harvesting my stuff? Huh. You dirty little berry thief. Okay. Yeah, greedy little bird. Who's a good lamby kins? Stop. I was... God dang it, bird boy. I was trying to pet the lamb. You're a good bird. You're pissing me off, but you're a good bird. Get back in the ball. Yep. What am I going to name the sheep? I don't know how to name it. Do I do it in here? Yeah. Oh, son of a... <laughs> uh, view details. Perfect. Actually, you know what? We should name them after members. Alright, this is gonna be RM. Perfect. I like this menu. Work speed, 70. We've got handiwork, transporting, and farming. Sweet. So we can tell what type of things each pal does. Uh, Penguin Boy. You need a name. View details. You're good at handiwork, transporting, cooling, and watering. You're going to be Bree. One of the 50 billion Brees. You know what? We're going to name this one Bree 520. That way we know which Bree is what, right? All right, Bree, you get to be the plant watering person. There you go. I like that they just fall out of the freaking sky. Oh my god, look at you. Who's a cutie freaking sleeping thingy, my boober? Yeah. Son of a biscuit! I just wasted another ball. Alright, make another straw bed. We need wood. Do they evolve? I actually do not know. I think we use resources directly out of the box. The burl upgrade is great. <laughs> Alright, we need to make a shoddy bed so we can level stuff up. Our bed's gonna be up here. We're gonna put it under this tree. Oh, it needs a foundation. <gasps> well, god dang it. How do I do that? A wood foundation. This looks like a good place for our first house, right? And then, we can just put a bed on top of it, I assume. Yeah, that's, we definitely need a bigger house. Build it all four by four. Uh, 
Oh, man, what happened with the directional of the grains and the stuff? God dang it. I need more wood. The water pal and the grass pal are good at farming. I mean, I kind of figure this. Thankfully, the, the way the pals work is pretty, pretty self-explanatory there. Fireboy is going to be good at cooking and stuff. Probably lighting stuff on fire. Water is going to be good at making things wet. There are shiny versions of the Pokemon. You can, there's also a breeding system. And you can breed pals together to give them different elements and different like rare versions of them. So there's, there's a lot to the game. Um, there's a whole obviously base defense and raid system. The pals uh, are a workforce. They can protect the base. There's, it's, it's actually really, really cool. What? Oh, God. I wonder if we can sleep through the night. That would make my streaming life so much better. I need a roof too. Well, I only needed to build it to level up to level three. Then I can place another pal in here. And we can uh, get the next mission. Build the feedbacks, build three pal straw beds. We're gonna let them all sleep next to each other. A little pal paradise. Anyone know if you'll be able to form parties or clans? Um, there is a thing uh, for forming parties. I don't know if that's just with your Pokemon, but I mean, there will be 32 player things. I imagine people just play together to, to live together. I don't know, I don't know how it's going to work, honestly. Nighttime has some cool pals as well. Someone was trying to do a 100-day challenge for it. It's not really a challenge. You just play the game for 100 days, but everybody does those nowadays. The PAL black market's going to be popping. Upgrade. Deploy a work PAL to base. Two out of four. Boop. All right, you need a name. You are going to be... Erica. We need to get a kitty. Or some kind of grass thing. What is this thing? Oh, this is a grass one. This will plant stuff for us. Uh, this is going to be... Who's the lucky one that's going to be this one? Uh, we got Desiree. There we go. Perfect. All right, now we got our crops being planted. And why are you licking it, Desiree? What are you doing? Is that how you plant seeds in this world? <laughs> what the heck? Oh, my lord. Build a Cal Pal Gear workbench and build a statue of power. Noise. And I need to eat. That's not how you garden? Tell that to the pals. They think that's definitely how you garden. We need a wooden door. Put that right there. 
Got a nice little wall. Got a nice little window. To the walls. To the pals drip down, yo. There we go. God! <laughs> Lord hath mercy on my soul. There we go. A beautiful. Yeah, squirt those plants. <laughs> that chicken is haunting you. <laughs> it's it's brutal. I want to go touch one of those green things over there. You know, what do you think I'm doing, Nathan? You gotta have walls before you can build a roof, Nathan. Keep your pants on, buddy. Got this. I'm sorry, Nathan, you didn't have to remove your message. Gee, who knew Tag be a slave driver with pants on? Oh my god. Why are you licking everything? Put your tongue away. Does my character look like Zeus? Because I'm awesome. Alright, we got a slanted roof. Sorry, Nathan, come back. Baby, come back. You can blame it all on. Not me. Look, Nathan, you're getting your roof, buddy. Did you you believed in me, right? Nathan was probably back in time, to be fair. Uh-oh. Uh, one roof bit, please. Just like a battle royale? What? Go play Fortnite. We don't need more battle royales. We got like so we got so many of them. How do I how do I do? Build continuously. Oh. Tag people have feelings also? I know. Why is this? Fine. See if I care. It's a lean to now. It's a little storage area. Try and screw me with the roof building. I'll turn this happy little accident into a fancy little tree, okay? I'll freaking Bob Ross the hell out of this building. Look, this is a storage area now. Joke's on you, game. Overlaps with other objects. What? I'll still freaking Bob Ross this. This is going to be fine. It's a story. Look, the Pokemon get to sleep in here. The pals, rather. I'll put some beds under there. It's going to be great. I don't have any wood. Oh, yeah, we need to build a freaking ranch. We need wood and stone. It's a perfect spot for pal beds. See? Exactly. We gotta go. We gotta go more pal hunting. I did. I just wanted to get the. I wanted to figure out. Oh, pals without beds will get stressed. That's right. All right, we need some wood. The roof thing is a known bug. Well, that's good. I'll, don't worry, I'll give the pals more work to do. Oh, Desiree, have a wonderful day. 
RM's out here eating all the berries on us. Alright, we need to repair our weapons. We need to build another bed. We need another ranch. Overlaps with other objects. What? Ayah! <laughs> Special pal bed sleeping spot. All right, well, I want to build one ranch, and then we're gonna we're gonna go back hunting through the wild. I figure like having a ranch for egg collection and stuff is probably a pretty good life choice, you know. Excited to see you play this game. Just found out about it yesterday and can't wait for it to come out on Friday. Oh, shoot. Wait. I forgot we need to repair our, our axe. Nice. We should probably require, uh, repair our uh, taming weapon. Our friend-making club. Uh, Lori, thank you for the 29 months. And yeah, ladies and gentlemen, if you are enjoying this dream, a like would be appreciated. Helps out so much when we play a new game. I think we needed 50 wood for the ranch. We definitely don't want to fully deplete our stamina. It takes much longer before we can do... Oh, god dang it. We need thicker bags. Was letting the doors out to do the business. <laughs> Ooh. Ah! Son of a... How do I stop it? God. I don't want to be on fire. Can I please not? <laughs> Can't you assign your pals to get wooden stone? Um, somehow. Oh, look, I'm still learning. There's still a lot to learn. I'm trying, though. I think we automatically grab stuff out of boxes, too. I'm not 100% sure, but I feel like relatively not unsure about it, you know? A leaf, huh? Some ore. We're going to find out. So you're saying I can level up my stats, huh? We got technology we can learn. Like, do we? There's ancient technology. Oh, there is a guild. You can make a guild. Uh, change guild name. This is going to be... Uh, failboat. Perfect. Members list, you can have 20 people in a guild. Buck, buck, buck. Ah, enhanced stats. There we go. So we've got work speed. We've got weight. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Yes. You missed the fire? Yeah, we caught on fire. It happens. I'm hoping that we automatically gather st or use items in boxes within our within our town. I don't know though. All right, there we go. 
we can get different panels to gather resources for us. Yeah, we're going to do that once we... Because we're about to head out. I just wanted to get some stuff built before we... We go out into the wilderness. We got our first ranch. Gotta build a mall, ranchy mound. Yeah, so all of them are gonna go build this now. We need to make sure everybody eats, everybody sleeps. This takes a long time to harvest. Look at him go. Gumboy seems to be missing. Passive skills Zen Zen Mind, huh? So increase your player level by capturing 30 pals. Alright, so RM's eating berries. We're going to need to catch a chicken to add to our little chicken coop, so let's do that. Ooh, also, we need we need stone. I need to make more of those Pokeballs. Any lucky pals yet? No, we haven't done a lot of catching of pals yet. Uh, we've been working on building our base and upgrading it and just kind of getting some stuff prepped here. And then, um, then we'll be good to go. We can add one more pal, which is going to be our first chicken, which we're going to assign to the chicken coop. And then we're going to head out and see if we can find some fun stuff. Challenge a boss at Ranch Syndicate Tower. Make sure your pals are equipped in top condition. Yeah, intriguing. Dude bro seems to be missing for some reason. There we go. Now he's back. Maybe he was sleeping. I don't know. Fingers crossed your first lucky is awesome. I don't know how uncommon the lucky, the lucky pals are either. So our pals were auto-collecting materials earlier. I don't know why they're not now. Alright, let's go. Oops. I gotta make more Pokeballs, or Pal Balls, or Pal Spheres, whatever they're called. I think I have one. Uh, Kativa is one of the best Pal for a home base. I definitely need to capture one. I've accidentally killed a few, because I didn't realize that I didn't have any more Pal Balls. <laughs> But yes, yeah, so we will be catching some Kativa. Capture success. We get an XP bonus for capturing a bunch of them, too. <gasps> Look at that thing over there. What the heck is that? Right, how does this thing work? Oh, they're just... Oh, it's just automatically happening. That's kind of cool. Interesting. All right, chickpea. There you go. Passive skills serious. Why so serious? Oh, shoot. We need another bed. Dang it. There's always something to do. I want to get one of those deer. That deer thing looked freaking cool. Man, how do I not have wood? Yeah, they'll build that. I literally just showed the guild tab, but there's nothing really to show. You can name your guild, and uh, you can have up to 20 members. There's a fire, pal! It's our first one. Oh, what is that thing? That thing looks cool. Wait. Pokeballs. Pokeballs. Pal balls. Pal spheres. Nonsense. Get the deer. I, I will. I'm going to get the deer. I'm going to get that fire one, too. That fire one was running away, though. Man, 
Man, I want that deer so bad. It's level nine. And ick <laughs> deer? I feel like that thing is about to like I feel like they're gonna team up on us. I don't like that. Fox parks? Come back here. What? Get, come here. Come here. Oh, I'm gonna get you. Yes. Oh, freaking fireball. What do we got? 57%? Come on, baby. Yes. Yes. Flame organs. That doesn't seem safe. All right, so we've got we got some progress here. I'm liking our party so far. What is this? A lim a, a limb monk effigy. Collect and offer them to a statue of power to improve your ability to capture pals. So these are pretty important. There was one right here. So on the map, this is where you start. You go down through the uh, through the road. And just inside this little, like, ruin area is one. And there's also another one nearby, too. I don't know how many we need for... What is this big blue egg? A large, damp egg. That's gotta be one of those squirting boys. We need to get an egg incubator. Yeah, the statue is something we can build. So, just across this way, there's another one. Can we swim? Yes. How big is the map? It seems pretty big. I'll show it in a second. Sweet. So we got another effigy right there. Pretty close to each other. They're probably all over the place. Large egg equals large pal equals cool. <laughs> okay. I don't think we have the ability to make an incubator yet. So we need to build a Cal Pal Gear workbench, and we haven't we don't have one of those yet. I'm assuming we need to level up for that. Alright, we've been using Chicken Boy for a little bit. So maybe we use Let's use Kremis for a little bit. You're a new face, don't tell me. An outsider. Not that it matters to me. Now that you're on the island, why not try to catch some pals? You can get extra XP from capturing up to ten of the same kind, you know. You know what they say, pal tamers get stronger the more pals they capture. Here, take this, I've got high hopes for you. Ooh, a palladium fragment. Is there any fusion in this game? There's breeding, which does things. I guess what we should do is we should just capture a couple of these bad boys. Oh shoot, I missed. Yeah, baby. Oh shoot. Oh my god, Desiree just clapped him. Lord hath mercy. Yeah. Increases attack power of neutral power. Sometimes drops wool when assigned to the ranch. Nice. You can capture inhumans in the palosphere, but it's considered inhumane. That's that's good to know. Oh, we got a freaking floaty boy over there. Floaty stingray, dude. The deers are gone. Oh, stop murdering everything. Who hurt you? Other than me. That's besides the point. We gotta go into this cave. I don't know what that's all about, but caves usually mean good stuff. Oh, it's a freaking dungeon. Hellside Cavern, level 13? <laughs> I think not. 
Yeah, I catch one of these bad boys, though. And you looked a lot bigger from far away. That's what she said. <gasps> what is that? The freaking elephant pig. It's a tea font. It's a little teapot pig. God, he almost murdered again. RM, thank you for the five gift memberships, you wonderful human. I appreciate you. You want some of this? RM, thank you so very, very much. And welcome, Kieran, Steffi, ABC, Habtab, McGarrr. <laughs> Welcome and welcome back to the community, you wonderful humans. Uh, also, we will be hosting um, servers for this. I don't know exactly how it's going to work, but they are up to 32 players. As always, uh, I will be sharing the invite codes to members of the community to be able to play along. We got a chest right there. Let's see what's in this bad boy. What on earth is this game? Probably a game we're all going to love. We got gold coins, arrows, and a mega sphere. Ooh, we should use that on the deer when it comes back. <gasps> There's a golden chest right here too. There's chests literally everywhere. We got a freaking egg. What is this? I haven't seen a golden one yet. We got gold coins, small parcels, and bread. I don't know if gold is better than purple. It feels not as better. Not as better. That's those good words. You want some of this, big boy? Yeah, you do. Oh, you're about to get clapped. Yeah. Nailed it! I have unspent stat points. I'm gonna go with more HP. I feel like that's gonna come in useful. Definitely want to learn the fire arrows. A wood living room furniture set. Oh, statue of power. There we go. Pal gear workbench. Oh, we got a little... A harness for holding fox parts. Oh. A wood tavern set. We can get drunk with our pals? <laughs> oh, don't even threaten me with a good time. Really nice Pokemon ripoff. Pokemon wishes it was as cool as this. A lift monk, huh? You about to be my new friend, buddy. Get him. Get him. Where are you going? I feel like it's luring me to a trap. I don't think you're going to escape back here, buddy. Pal. Parrish, thank you for becoming a majestic bean. Welcome to the community. Thank you so much. Wow, this thing's got a lot of HP. Is this a spe This got to be a special creature of some sort. Oh, shoot. Yeah. I missed. Ooh, 45%, huh? Come on. Oh, yes. Intelligent as a five to seven year old human child. It makes a wonderful partner, but there have been more than a few cases where they've killed their master after learning to use weapons. <laughs> what? Okay. That's that's great. We got another one of these um, lift monk statues. It is right here on the map. So you start here and you can come along this little path here across the little... Uh, beach, and there's another statue here. This increases the levels of pals we can acquire. Lift monk energy. Alright, it's getting dark. We should head back to base. Oh, there's another lift monk statue up there. Ladies and gentlemen, we got, uh, for 900 people watching, less than 300 likes. 
I hate saying it, but it helps out so much. YouTube's like happy nowadays. Um, so if you do want to help out, I'd greatly appreciate it. We can just hang out and chat and see what this crazy game has to offer us. Can use fox sparks as a fire source. That's true. Nice. That actually works out really, really well. It's a good pal to have around with you at nighttime, I'll tell you what. It's 446 now? Oh, hell yeah. Thank you, everybody. Y'all are the real MVPs. <gasps> Depresso! <laughs> Is that my spirit Pokemon? There's two of them, too. Oh, oh, oh. Quit with the squirting, buddy. Yeah. Nailed it! Let's freaking go. They're venomous, too. We got some kind of wonky boy over there, too. What is that thing? Old Depresso. Looks like my soul the past few days. Oh no. Oh dude, what is that? Oh, that thing. It's like a fancy Depresso. Oh, they're like little sleepy dudes. Which one are we attacking first? This one? I'm kind of glad our pals are... Oh, shoot. These things are harder to catch. All right, come on. Club it like a baby seal. Yeah, 80%. Okay. I like this. I'm getting used to the, like, the catching process. You want some of this, big boy? Oh, shoot. Oh, God, we killed it. It's okay. Oh, now everybody wants to wake up. Good evening, sheep people. All right, enhance stats. We're going to go with more stamina. One more thing of weight. Feel pretty good about that life choice. We need to make a bow and a fire bow if we can. So a fire bow is wood, stone, and fiber. And a regular bow. A bow weapon that deals fire damage to use the fire arrow. A bow capable of long-range attacks, hastily put together. It isn't very powerful. So I think we should... Oh, we can make a spear, too. Shoot, we need to do so much stuff. Build. Oh, the Statue of Power. <gasps> The frickin' Hookrates are here. Music is just disabled for copyright, right? No, it's uh I don't think there I don't think there is any. Get a new squirrel pal on your base to fetch you some wood. Oh, that's a good point. We need to upgrade. I'm going to upgrade our base again so we get six pals. We need to start getting some gathering ones for sure. Bro's fighting the most magical beings in the universe with a bonk stick. Look, it's the best way to live life, okay? If, you don't, if you're not using the bonk stick, are you really even living life, you know? I don't think so. So we get details on each of these. Transporting, we got watering. Depresso is mi Depresso mines. Okay, Depresso, you get to you get to do something. 
I guess we don't need two wool boys. All right, who's going to be Depresso, our miner? <laughs> Get to work. You know what? It's going to be Disco. Welcome to the workforce, Disco. <laughs> May your stay be great. <laughs> what does this person do? Ooh, gathering. Okay. Planting. So we don't have a gatherer yet. Oh, we got Chicken Boy. Who needs a level? Something's fighting over there. Then we got uh, Jatina. Perfect. Nailed it. Oh, he's just mining over there. Perfect. Okay, I think we can sleep through the night. We also need to build... A... Oh, man. I want to get us all drunk. We need the Palgear workbench. We need 30 wood. Disco should have been the penguin. Disc- Oh, I'm Disco the slave. You want to be a penguin slave? Don't give the fireboat to the squirrel, pal. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> that seems like a terrible good time. Let's all get day drunk. I feel like everybody needs to get day drunk. All right, you, Bree... You do watering, you do cooling, which is cool. Yeah, we just need to level up is what we're going to do. So we need to put a, yeah, Pal Gear workbench and a Statue of Power. And then we could put Squirrel Boy down. God dang it, Bobby. Change Licky Tongue for Squirrel Boy? Well, we need it for the planting of the... I want somebody to do everything, so we just need to level up and we can get Squirrel Boy out. Beautiful. Alright, now we need to build the Statue of Power. Power! And we'll put it in the middle of the base. No, we'll put it next to the house. Hope this game comes out sometime soon. It comes out tomorrow. Actually, two days. Comes out on the 19th, right? Friday? Today's Wednesday? I don't know what today is, honestly. I think it's Wednesday. Alright, so now we can upgrade. Base upgrade! Build a crusher, a stone pit, and a logging site. Oh my god. We're about to really start enslaving some people. Man, look at look at Disco just carrying that egg right now. Just me like, god dang it, I'm freaking dragging these eggs across the the whole freaking world right now. Mm -mm -mm. Looks so happy right now. Poor Disco. I'm assuming they take it directly to the food storage place. Can I be a slave tag? I'll work happily. Like anybody willing to be our farm slave can be our farm slave, you know? All right, let's um, do, do, do pal box management. We need to put old Lift Monk down here. So Lift Monk, if we view details, is a planting. Oh, they do planting, lumbering, gathering. Oh, what? Medicine production? They're actually amazing. Who gets to be amazing? Uh, we'll do Sheevies. There we go. Boom. Requires submachine gun. Oh, my God. I can be your penguin pimp. Wouldn't be the first time. Oh my god. The old penguin pimp. 
Oh yeah, now we're straight cooking. Alright, um, we don't need Chicopee. We don't need a T-Font with us. I do kind of like this party right here. Alright, let's go see if we can find the deer. The, the I'm pretty sure the deer Pokemon came out in the morning. We need more Pokeballs, though. They need pats for their hard work. You know what? You're right. We'll give everybody some good pats. We'll make some new Pokeballs. We'll give everybody pats. And, uh, hold on. I'll be right back. Okay. You volunteer for the fire one? I gotta find another one. We need to make another storage box probably too. I was petting real life pals, okay? Don't judge me. I was living my best life right now. We need to increase our stamina. We also need to use the, ooh, I'm hungry. Oh, that's probably what the stamina problem is. All right, we need more pal, pal spheres. And I want to catch that deer one. That deer pal looked pretty fire. Look at all that god dang wood. Oh my god, you're a champion. Oh my god, it all entered my body all at once. That was pretty great. That was pretty phenomenal. How do you make food? Kill pals? Yeah. Exactly as you do in Pokemon. Where do you think all the food comes from in Pokemon? So we can enhance player stats. Capture power, huh? Yeah. And then enhance pals. Oh. Oh. You can do... Oh, I'm going to save that. All right, so we need to... Uh, Technology. We need a logging site, a stone pit, and a crusher. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> All right. Don't threaten me with a good time. We need 50 wood, 50 stuff. Oh my god, we need all the stuff. Aren't the pals in my party hungry? I don't think so. Oh, they've been eating, see? Fireboy was a little hungry. Many questions what the Crusher's gonna crush. My anticipation is the Crusher's gonna be crushing some pals. Oh yeah, I said I was going to give everybody pets. I'm sorry. All right, let's make a logging site. We'll make that right here along the road. This will be great. Yeah, get to work. That's right. Good job, Bree. Sheevies. Disco. And RM, y'all putting in the putting in the good work. Who's gonna get some good pets though? Who's a good bird? Perfect. Also naming all the pals after followers and then using them as food. It's gonna be interesting when that happens. Shh. Look, if you're doing good work, I'm not going to eat you, okay? 
Wow, 9,999 potential wood here. Oh my god, yeah. Good job, Sheevies. Oh my god. You're doing the Lord's work right now. All right, we need more stone. We need more of those squirrel things. My god. We got all the wood we needed. Now we need a little bit more stone. Do a good job or your dinner. Pal is missing a bed. Oh yeah, I need to fix that. Y'all doing the good, good looking out for me. I appreciate you. I didn't sign up for this. Oh, but you did. And you're doing good work. Is this weapon broken right now? Yup. Dang it. Oh my god. Alright, Depresso. We're making your stone pit, buddy. In celebration of my purple corgi, click that like button, all you lurkers. Uh, Bree, thank you for the 13 months and congratulations on the uh, the purple corgi. And thank you so much for the year. Appreciate you very much. It's probably an auto transfer button, huh? Take all quick stack. There we go. Makes life so much easier. We need to get an incubator. All right, things are growing. We need to make one more pal bed. Ooh, need wood. We got any in here? <laughs> I like this. Bet Dusko, he looks depressed. His. <laughs> he literally is a depresso. Of course he's depressed. Yordi, thank you for coming to Super Bean. Welcome to the community. Thank you very much. Dusko does look like he's having a really bad day. All right. Do you ever get happy? Oh, there we go. Now, instantly depressed again. All right, then we need one crusher. We need 50 wood and stone. Then we'll get our final level up that we need. And we're going to go out and try and... I'm, I keep looking for those deer over there, but I don't see them yet. Beautiful. Oh, Depresso. Oh. Oh, that's so sad. Work faster. <laughs> the penguin's so happy about its rock carrying life, though. Sad, but get to work, Depresso. <laughs> get a cat, they gather stone quick. Yeah, I'll do that. Just want to make our crusher. I 
think we got everything we need for the crusher. Need wood. Oh, and palladium fragments. Whoops. Tree didn't stand a chance. I want to get a Pokey Pokey 9000 too. Oh, I play it now? Uh, you can't. It fully releases on Friday. Um, there are creators that got early access to it to be able to play it early. Um, it's a pretty good spot for a base. There's resources absolutely everywhere. Exactly. This is working out really, really well for us. The game will cost $29.99. It'll be on Steam. It's also on Xbox Game Pass, which, so if you have that, it's basically free. Obviously, you have to pay for Xbox Game Pass. Oh, there's a large green egg over there. I don't know what those things do yet, but I'm going to collect them. And yes, it officially comes out Friday at 3 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Which most people won't be awake. But still, that's when it comes out. A large verdant egg, huh? Verdant. Sounds fancy. And Steam Deck, so far people have no issues playing on Steam Deck. That is actually pretty awesome. A good open world survival game on the Steam Deck? Ooh. It's exciting. Whoever lives in this bed is going to be really upset he's spaghetti about all the noise out here, but... Tis the life. Skidmark! Skids, thank you for the five gift memberships. Thank you so very, very much. Yeah, we need an egg incubator. So we need an ancient... Oh, wow. We need two ancient civilization parts and five cloth. Interesting. <clears throat> bam, bam, bam. Who's a good chicken? Yeah. Oh, son of a god dang it, I keep doing that. I need to rebind that button. All right, and Izzy, have a wonderful night. Is it split-screen co-op? What? Oh, stuff doesn't even really exist anymore. Oh, we can even work here. Interesting. That's that's not efficient. We're going to make one more bed. And we're going out and explore. We're going to see if we can find those ancient civilization parts. I'm also going to make sure to put our... These big eggs that we have found in storage. Just in case I die and something goes horribly, horribly wrong. I feel like that's a pretty good idea. Guess we'll make some fried eggs. We'll upgrade to level seven. Ooh, a hot spring, a primitive furnace, and a berry plantation. We need another berry plantation. The Firefox is so pretty. Yeah. All right, what can we build on uh, no usable recipes? Well, butter my butt and call me a biscuit. All right, we're going to repair everything and then we're going to head out. Oh, I should probably build our spear.
Who's a good penguin? And do we have enough to build another storage box? Of course not! R on the repair table repairs all tools. Oh! Ain't that convenient. Oh, shoot. Normal parachute. Definitely want one of those. I wonder if this is something that, like, automatically activates. Like, we don't have to have it. We don't have to, like, cycle to equip it, rather. Oh, hi, tier. That's a repair kit. Definitely should make more of these. Oh, Nikki, thank you for the five gift memberships. Thank you so much. Delcat runs with pencil. Pity the violins. Mally and Robert. Everyone, welcome and welcome back. Right, we wanted to make another storage box. I just used all of our wooden stone. Never mind. God, tear. You almost made me kill the penguin, buddy. Stop it. Tear. Look, I love you. You're a good boy. But can you at least, like, lay over here? Look, you don't have to leave. I'm not kicking you out. Try to lay out your butthole on the screen and where I can use the mouse. All right, maybe we should get the wooden stone. No, something keeps telling me like I'm gonna lose these eggs and that they're good and that I should not risk losing them. Lurkers unite and smash that like button. <laughs> Thank you, Sandrasa. And yes, to all the wonderful lurkers out there that I never get to say hello to. Hope your day is going well. Yeah, this spot that we chose for our base just has like all the, the basic resources that we need. Which is really nice. I'll put another chest over here. eggs in there. And you get more pals, you catch them. Nice, so we got 10, 15. All right, that'll do. Tear. Um, Cindy, we don't really know. I mean, the game's not officially out. We won't really know what the servers are going to actually run like until the game is officially out yet. <clears throat> oh, shoot. It's already almost nighttime. Uh, let's see if we can sleep. Beautiful. Beautiful. Now we're gonna see if we can find another one of those squirrel boys. This is pretty much Ark survival with Pokemon and rifles. This is it's essentially yeah, it's like it's like if Ark, Pokemon, and like Genshin Impact, well, I guess not Genshin Impact, um, Breath of the Wild would be more accurate. I mean, Genshin Impact, Breath of the Wild. It's like basically if the three of those all had a had a baby and, uh, and you could play it. And that's what this is. So far, really enjoying it. Seems like there is a lot to do. Ooh, Pal Spheres everywhere, hell yeah. We gotta try out the new Pokey Pokey 9000. Get them levels. Oh, shoot. 
shoot. Ice boys. Whoa. Fire vs. Ice seems like a pretty great idea. Heck yeah. Excited to try this game out. Looks like a, a fun mix of stuff. Hell yeah. It's I'm really, really enjoying it so far. Yeah, we're definitely going to be unlocking more quick travel points soon. We need to get a Cattiva for the base. Tear. Oh my god. Sweet baby Jesus, dude. You got a big old cat dump truck, okay? You don't need to put it everywhere. The game is available on PC and Xbox uh, Game Pass. Definitely going to run better than Craftopia since it's uh, Unreal Engine. Yeah. Tear. Dude. You have fluffy dude. But you don't need to put your giant cat dump truck on my hands. What's this all about? What's oh, an arrow? Oh, you don't want to catch the stabby stab 9000? <gasps> A large damp egg. You don't necessarily need to recall your pals. You just need to make sure that you whoops that you re, that you uh, throw out the sphere before your pal attacks is all. <gasps> the deer. This is what we've been looking for. Yeah. Oh, it's level 11 too. Shoot. This might not go well. <gasps> oh shoot. Oh snap. Oh Christ on a muffin. Ooh, 28%. Okay. <gasps> oh? Oh, hell yeah. You won't be able to effectively use pals at a higher level than you. I don't even care. We freaking caught it. Ooh, it done clap my cheeks, though. God dang. Ooh, a Vixie. <gasps> There's an electric Pikachu Pokemon over there. It's called Spark It. Oh, snap. Who's your daddy? Me. Oh, hell yeah. yeah. We're straight cruising now, I'll tell you what. Oh, we got mushrooms? Shoot. Ooh, what's this bad boy up here? Is that... It's a thwack? Thwack it! <laughs> oh, God, you are ugly. Oh, you're... Bad. You're dead. Sorry, buddy. Ooh, another megasphere and some bread. Similar does not mean same. There's a little town over there. Roxas, thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you very, very... Oh, what are you? What the fwack was that? Exactly. What is this, though? This thing is humongous. Look how thick you are. 
Oh, you're about to be my new friend. Oh, snap. Oh, you just got Clapasaurus Rex right in the butt. What you gonna do about it? Oh, God. Get in that ball. It's a Capriti. Oh, shoot. Come on, baby. Let's go. Get in the ball. Look, I got that one right in your balloon knot. Oh, snap. There we go. Oh, shoot. Oh! Oh man, I got Clapasaurus Rexed. Discount no flying Maywing. <laughs> oh, whoa. Oh. Respawn points, huh? Pal population resource amount. Look at that. This map is huge. Like can I I can't respawn at my base? There we go. Oh, that sucked. Okay. Oh. Well, at least we got to see what it looks like when you die. Alright, we gotta go back and pick up our stuff. Thankfully we weren't that far away. Oh, you naked. I am naked. That's pretty crazy. I don't know why that one wouldn't... I probably needed a larger sphere. I just didn't know how during combat to switch up spheres. I think we went this way, right? Then we went up there. Will it be multiplayer? Yes, it is 32 player multiplayer. We will be playing with other people. This looks like Ark combined with Pokemon. It's pretty much what it is. It's a it's a pretty good representation of uh, of what it is. It's an open world crafting survival game. So whichever open world survival game you wanna name it like it is, um, you can do that. There's a freaking pig boy over here. Uh, mixed with uh, monster catching. It's a rush whore. That thing looks like uh, from Monster Hunter. Those things suck. Oh, shoot. And they even have the attack like it's Monster Hunter. Oh, boy. Freaking pork chop over there. We're gonna, we gotta get one of those. And that sucked. Oh, we got the Capriti meat. We got angry, angry duck boys over here. I want to go catch that pig. There are mounts. We have not gotten one yet. Actually, I think the uh, the deer that we have is technically a mount. Yeah. Um. I feel like the club almost works better than the... Oh shoot, pig boy. Get in there. Oh shoot. Why doesn't anything want to be caught now? Yeah. Weird. Yeah, everything's... Everything's being a bit more of a pain to catch. Super weird. Zirkin, thank you for the five gift memberships. My god, thank you everybody for the gift memberships today. Y'all are wonderful. Thank you so much. We're going to increase that, uh, that health again, I think. Poison bow. We've got a necklace. Necklace. 
A wooden tavern, ooh, tundra outfit, hot spring. There we go. And welcome Vinny, Cyndia, Sir Sith, <laughs> Nick, and Brittany. Welcome, welcome. And Ariel, thank you for the 16 months. Hope you're doing well. I don't know what's down here, but let's go check it out. Oh, it's a small settlement. Nice. We got a fast travel point, too. Hell yeah. Oh. We got dudes with guns down here. A reliable pitiff officer. What you munching on down here, big boy? A gossiping villager. Uh, ever explored a cave? I've heard that caves are home to loads of unique pals. What's more, there are even treasure troves created by pals with a knack for collecting stuff. Give me a shot if you spot any caves, won't you? Oh, I spotted one, but I ain't telling you where it was. There's one right there. Who are you, Captain Fancy Pants? We got a wandering merchant. We can buy and sell stuff here. A long-eared headband schematic. We got pal spheres. We got medical supplies. A witch hat schematic. A bowler hat? I kind of want that witch hat. Oh, Jude, have a wonderful day. I think we should go into our first cave. How many Pokeballs do we have? We have 10 left. Let's see what level this cave is before we commit to this. Level 13. Okay. Mayhap not. What? Disco is slacking off. Disco, get back to work. What do you think you're doing? Alright, so thankfully we can fast travel to and from our base now, which is nice. Cave is big. Yeah, I want to go into a cave. We're just not very high level yet. Snackers get snackered? Yeah, you're gonna be a snack. I want to build the hot spring, because the hot spring will help um, keep everybody nice and happy, you know? We also needed more food, more pal spheres. Am I missing stone? Who's not doing good work? We got 12 wood over here, 60 stone. Tear, bro, you don't need to paw my face, dude. You know what? Disco was putting in work there for a little bit. All right, we wanted to. Who's this dude? What does this dude do? Uh, generates electricity. Okay. What about Deer Bro? What does Deer Bro do? Lumbering level two. Ooh. What's Catboy do? Stop touching it. Uh, mining level one, huh? All right, we'll, we'll use that here. Get rid of this. I can't really use the deer yet, so we're gonna put deer down here. So we can get some lumber. Can ride the deer eventually? Yeah, that's what I'm looking forward to. Oh yeah, that works way better. I pet that booty. Can't wait for the grind. Aw, oh, yeah. That good old grind. All right, we need to make a hot spring. We need wood and pal. Ooh, I needed to get some fluid. I need to go kill some duck boys. And something that drops some water. We need to eat, too. <gasps> wait, what are those? I've never seen those things before. It's some kind of, like, chicken thing. A melpaca. What the heck? And it's level 10? Are we gonna get our cheeks clapped? I'm on my spear. Tear, dude. 
I feel like we really need to invest in the bow. I have not found anything in the game that makes it unplayable as of yet. I've not found any major bugs, anything that really bothers me. It's been it's been a really good experience so far, honestly. What kind of fever dream is this animal? It's no different than the fever dreams of uh some of the other Oh god dang it. Look at that beautiful berry field, yes. What am I doing with my life? There we go. Would I recommend the game so far? Would you like a tip about getting uh, continual spheres, Mistress? I would love that. What's the What's the tip? I mean, I've got I've got so many videos to make about this game too. Like, I plan on covering content for it. So, any tips that y'all have gotten from the time that you've watched, um, please even feel free to reach out on Discord and stuff if you want. Like, I want to make sure that. Uh, everybody is as knowledgeable about the game as possible. I super want to know if there's a breeding or a shiny style version of things. There is, Stamp. There is breeding. There's crossbreeding, and there are shinies, too. I haven't gotten any shinies yet. I don't know if you can see them in the overworld, either. I imagine you can. Like, that fox boy looking pretty fire right now. Literally. And yes, give me, give me the knowledge. What can I drop here? Oh, it can be crafted at the primitive workbench. Okay. Um, I need to... I need to drop something. Bones, maybe? No, I feel like I should keep those. I need to figure out how to use different spheres, too. It's only effective on low-level pals. Okay, that explains why we've been struggling to catch some of the higher-level stuff. The shiny is called Lucky, and they do show. Yes, perfect. They're sparkly in the open world, I believe, and bigger. Ooh. And yes, thank you, everybody, for getting us to a 1,000 viewers today. That is absolutely amazing. Y'all are wonderful. What I think of the game, what would you rate it? Worth the hype. You know, honestly, I wasn't sure what to what to expect. I, I, I had hopes for it. But so far, I mean, I'm not even getting to play. I haven't played a ton of it yet. We've played two hours and 18 minutes so far. Tier, oh my god. Um, but so far, it's everything I could have hoped for. It's really, really good. I'm, I'm enjoying the process. Have, we haven't even gotten into, like, the whole breeding and, like, lucky hunting and really expanding the base yet. Honestly, it looks great. I love open-world survival games, so tying that with a creature collecting game is everything I could have hoped for. So, do I recommend it? Yes, I don't usually recommend games this early. But so far, I've been really, really enjoying it. There is breeding in penguins. Sounds like the game is worth it. Oh my god, Disco, thank you for the super chat. Yeah, we haven't gotten to the guns yet, either. Um, there we go. We need to improve our weight. I don't know what to do with this. Witch hat. Cloth and an ingot. Ooh, okay. I'm going to wait to make more spheres. I feel like I missed the, the super secret squirrel comment. What mode is Tag playing on? Can I hear him as I'm still at work and I have the sound off? Oh my god. <laughs> I can't help there. What? We got horns, leather, we got the fluids here, we need to go get more of those, I know how to do that though, we're going to put all of our food away too. Put the bread in there, we got some fried eggs, I need to keep those fried eggs. Ooh, our meat is spoiling, our caperty meat. Ooh. Hmm. 
Something about you're supposed to be giving the squirrel a fire bow. Oh no. That seems dangerous. This seems very, very dangerous. Alright, we got more of those fire boys. Alright, let's go get the uh the rest of the water stuff that we need. We'll go out and murder some things some things. Get us some levels. Throw your Vixie in the ranch and it will dig up spheres for you. Throw my Vixie? I have a Vixie? What's wait, what, what's the Vixie? Throw your Vixie in the ranch and it will dig up spheres for you. That's pretty cool. Oh shoot, there's a thick sphere right there. Give everything a fire bow, clearly. Obviously. Oh, I will butt stab you into oblivion. Get back here. Yeah, I don't know where Avixi is, but that's. It looks like the Eevee. No. Vixie, we did catch one. And I know where they are, too. Alright, we'll do that. This is going to give us the fluid that we need. Perfect. We're going to keep collecting more of that fluid. Come here, big boy. God, they need a bow. Those little squirrels are back here, too. You know what? How do I... <laughs> Murder every... You know what? Screw that thing. <gasps> That's the thing that killed us. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Ooh. I feel like I shouldn't fight two of those. I think clapped our cheeks last time. No, screw it. We're using a fire one this time. Man, killing its friend while its friend is sleeping right next to it. That's dirty. Oh, hell yeah. Let's freaking go. I'm going to get another one. Wait, how do I change what kind of Pokeball I'm using? So I have, I have three in my inventory, but how do I choose which one? Head, body, sh we don't have a shield. We could make one. Nope. I don't know how to do that. Hmm. We'll let that one sleep. Oh my god, Gregory, thank you so much. Gregory, thank you for the 10 gift memberships. Sweet baby Jesus, thank you so much. Welcome, Guardian, Mistress Mink, Flannery, Miko, Salwain, Coas, Bud, Sad Human, Ariel, and Raven's Mod. Welcome to the community, and welcome back, many of you as well. Maybe it auto-selects based on PAL. That would be nice. It doesn't. You gotta hit two. There we go. So we can change the sphere with the two button. How's the game so far? I really like it. It seems like there's a pretty decent amount of depth to it. Uh, the survival game aspects are just like any other survival game you've played. So if you like the survival game genre, you'll probably like this. Uh, the crafting is pretty great. The so far, I've been really enjoying the the different types of uh, of pals that there are. The way that you can use them to upgrade your base and have them defend your base and stuff like that. So far, from the two hours and thirty minutes that I've played, I I really really like it. I can't see anything. I can't say that there's anything particularly bad about it at the moment. Love you, little...
We got the Hrukrates. Can you build anywhere? Yeah. Got more venom glands. Humans are the best pals. Oh boy. It is, uh, it is not single player, but it's not what would be considered an MMO either. You can play with up to 32 other people on a server. Well, 31 other people. 32 people to a server total. Alright, we're going to build this hot spring finally. Where do we want to put it? We'll put it next to the work camp. So that way they can take a break after working very hard. And we'll sleep through the night. Wow, we got a lot of wood there. That deer is so good at getting wood. Oh my god. And Chelsea, thank you for the 25 months. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Oh, man, that's so good. That is amazing. The work camp? Yeah, the work camp. <laughs> Alright, what else do we need to do to, to level up our, our thing here? We need uh, oh, a primitive furnace, and we need another berry plantation. Look at him go to work. <laughs> what level am I? I'm level nine. We're moving along pretty, pretty good at a, a relatively solid pace, I think. So we needed a primitive furnace. That means we need to hit level 10 to get that. We also have the tundra outfit and the tropical outfit now. We have the poison bow, which I think would be pretty good. I'm going to save my technology points, though. Oh, there's a bat. A baseball bat for close range combat might be tough to get home run with a pal. <laughs> I need that. We're going to use that as our new weapon. Did something just shoot me in the butt? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Swoe, my god! Oh, Depresso just got clubbed like a baby seal. We should make a shield. Game pass available? Yes. All right, new bonk stick. I wish I could tell how much damage the weapons did. <laughs> Alright, so... Oh, his attack is 35. Oh, the baseball bat is 50. Oh my god. All right, let's repair our stuff, then we'll head out. Is this a... We gotta be careful fighting stuff so close to base, because they will club it. Oh, bye, buddy. You should get in this ball before you're dead. Well, bye. I tried. He's dead. Gone, but not forgotten. That's for sure. Oh no, Andy. Yeah. Need to get that XP bonus. What the heck? 
Get in the ball. Weird. I wonder why things are becoming so much more difficult to to catch now. These give leather though, which we're definitely gonna need. Look at the bonk bat go. Whoops. Sometimes you bonk and other times you bonk too hard. <sighs> There's another deer. I want another one of those. They're so good at gathering wood. Oh God, sorry. I get a little too excited with the bonking. Get in the ball. Sphere, whatever you want to call it. Are you supposed to not murder them? Yeah. But sometimes murdering is what's required. Why is the deer in the water? Man, I wonder they're so hard to find. Definitely want another one of those deer, though. That one's only level 9, too. At least fight back. Well, they're getting clubbed like a baby seal with a bat. Not typically known to be easy to fight back when that's happening to your face. Uh, shinies exist, yes. They're called luckies. And you can see them in the overworld. Whoops. Ooh, there's another green egg over here. Really don't like that they're running from me. Yeah. Hi, friend. <laughs> All right, we need to catch two more. <laughs> don't you freaking escape. Good duck boy. Ooh, we're level 10. Beautiful. That's exactly what we needed. You want, you want some of this? Oh, don't you freaking butt icicle me. You can see the shinies in the overworld. They have like a little sparkle around them and apparently they're bigger too. Ooh, there's a new monkey boy over there we ain't never seen before. Oh, this is where all the squirrel bros live. The lift monks. There's a little tansy over there, too. Please come some penguins in my honor. Oh, we just did. Don't you worry. We'll club this little monkey boy. Oh, shoot. Just saw one streamer kill the shiny. Oh, no. Challenge the boss at Rain Syndicate's tower. Make sure your panels are equipped or in top condition is our next kind of beginning goal here. The monkeys are really good for your base. You want to catch a bunch? Nice. All right, I want to find a new fast travel point before we head back, because at least then we can come out this way again. So we're going to look for more monkey boys.
They call them lucky in this game instead of shiny. They're a lot bigger than the normal version, and they sparkle, just so you know what to look for. Yeah, we'll keep an eye out for them for sure. How do you get into early access? If you are a content creator, you can apply on their website. Is how uh, we are getting early access to be able to play a couple days early. It does officially release on Friday at 3 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Lucky chickens are huge. I kind of want to find a lucky chicken, if I'm being honest. Sounds pretty exciting. I wonder if these are actually worth getting. They're kind of like big and cute. This kind of looks collectible. It's not. Okay. I feel like there would be a fast. There it is. I was going to say, I was like, there should, it feels like there would be a fast travel point around here somewhere. They produce berries. That's pretty nice. Is there anything up here? No, just squirrels that can hold guns. Oh, what's this? A chillet? If it's being highlighted on the map, does that mean it's rare? It's gotta be, right? We gotta go we gotta go tame it. Or at least try, right? How do we get to it? Looks like it's up this mountain. Smack that like button. Torrance, thank you for the 44 months. Gun Squirrel, the movie. It's like a mini boss. Well, we're gonna find out. I want that flying bird Pokemon pal thing up there. Oh, shoot. Oh, snap. What the friggity frackity frick was that? It's a lichen rock. Dude, just clap some cheeks over here. This thing looks pretty cool. I'm about to club you like a baby seal, buddy. Oh, shoot. You got a whole freaking family. Oh, God. This isn't good. I didn't sign up for this. Oh, God. Get in the ball. Okay, we got two so far. Oh, shoot. Oh, no, our fox parks died. Get him, big boy. Woo. Ooh. Ooh, that was sketchy. Okay, so um, the, the wolves are a little bit grumpy. Just a little bit. I don't think we got a good team for fighting a boss right now. I feel like we might get Clapasaurus Rexed over here. But I kind of want to see what it looks like. This thing is pretty strong, these Caprides. <gasps> There's more monkey boys over here. We were told to catch more of those, so I think we're going to do that. Oh, shoot. Ooh, that was close. It looks so happy before I just start just clubbing it. I missed. Oh, dang it. I'm out of balls. Ooh, there's a chest over here. Nice. It's supposed to be here. But I don't see it. Oh, there it is. 
We'll poke it. What's the worst that could happen? Yeah. Ooh, we got a Megasphere, too. I don't know if we can catch these things. It's a level 11 Chillet. Dancer on the Plains. 1100 HP. It's an Ice Pokemon. We killed our Fire Pokemon. Pal, sorry. I don't know how to heal. Uh, incapacitated. All right, we're gonna try it. Oh my god. Man, little salamander boy going down. Oh, shoot. Man, that Pokemon with, or the, that pal with the vine thing is pretty freaking good. Because it slows them down. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on. Ooh, first boss. Hail, and we got an ancient technology point. That's how we unlock. Ooh, and we get the ancient civilization parts, which we need for getting the, uh, the incubator that we needed. So now we have everything but the stone and the cloth. That was really worth getting. Kato, what it do? Can I be the silly not worm? Sure. Oh yeah, that was super worth it. We're gonna catch this other deer over here. And then we're gonna head home. Oh Christ. Where's your HP bar? Oh God. God, these things hurt. It's the stampeding noodle. <laughs> That's exactly what we're going to call it. It's perfect. All right. I'm super glad we caught that. There's another fast travel point over here. Oh, and that's the Rain Syndicate Tower, too. We might as well, since that's our next thing, we might as well run over there, pick up the fast travel point. We'll get our, our pals ready for combat, and we'll try and take down the first tower. Shout out to YouTube for not giving you a live notification. Oh, no. Coming in late, do you get a starter pal? No, you just uh, you start off in the open world. You start crafting and gathering and uh, getting all the items that you need to be able to catch your own pals. Uh, so you don't have to pick a starter. You just kind of start the game. And you can pick whatever you want. I'm gonna... Ooh, there's a couple of them. I'm not going to touch those. Those things are grumpy. Plan to get this Friday. Nice. I think you can also catch the bosses in the Senesit. I want to try out to go into a cave today, too. All right, there's the fast travel point we wanted. Well, there's another cave here. Which one's the level is this one? Level 13. We're level 11. I feel like we can go in there pretty soon. Oh, there's a King Paka. Ooh. I, don't, I really, 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 really like this so far. This is better than I could have hoped. Uh, Kitty Cal, thank you for the 22 months. Oh, wow. Look at all the resources over here. Very nice. We can make the cloth now. Got plenty of wood. Have I played Craftopia? I, uh, I I played a couple times, yes. I have a couple streams of it on the channel. Mm. 
wasn't there a level 10 cave near me? I believe it was level 13. This is odd to say, but it's super refreshing to see that the game hasn't crashed yet. <laughs> yeah, we're going to put Vixie in the... Uh, we're going to put Vixie in. We're going to swap out a couple of our pals. Thank you, Parrish. That's a solid tip. Here. here. I don't want to be rude. Just lay down, buddy, okay? Lay down. I know you might be getting home soon. I'm going to miss your grumpy cat little face. So we wanted to build, or no, we want to acquire the egg incubator. We can make one now. Ooh, a saddle harness. Oh, we can ride the dire, ooh, okay. We can ride the bork bork, that's pretty cool. We got a high quality workbench. Oh, we've got the metal tools, a three shot bow. Oh my lord. We need to make the primitive fire pit first. A freaking bear trap. All right, let's get these higher quality tools first. Then we can get the bow. We got a wooden gate. We can get the submachine gun now. Oh my god. We can get the submachine gun now. This is terrible. We have uh, we are upgrading. Hmm, tiny little primitive furnace, put that up here. Put Vixie to work, Bish better have your balls. Oh my god. All right, we just need to build that primitive furnace and then we can put uh, Vixie out. How do you raise the dead pal? Uh, we're going to do that right now, actually. Base upgrade. All right, so what we need to do is we need to put Fox Sparks in here to be able to, and after 10 minutes, it'll be usable again. I don't know if we're going to use Hookrates. You can put Chicopee back. Um, Kremis seems pretty cool, but I don't want to use that. I like the deer. The dire hal, because I want to ride it. We've got Chillet, which is a boss. It knows freaking dragon cannon and ice missile. Then we got Capriti, which seems pretty good. And I do like Fox Sparks. We're going to wait for Fox Sparks to be back to, to heal to use again. And then we need to put Vixie down here. Which means we need to rename Vixie. Vixie is going to be... Brandy. Brandu. So, gathering and farming. Um, we got Duck Boy. Jatina is gathering and farming. We don't need two of these. Apparently, Monkey is really good. Oh, wow. Planting, handiwork, lumbering, gathering, and transporting. That's super good. Um, mining... So we need a name for our Tansy. That's going to be Scott. Sorry, Jatina, you've been fired for the day. Just for the day. What does the wolf do? Gathering. Generates electricity. Yeah, the monkeys seem to be the best. I think we can probably give RM a little bit of a break. We'll put another monkey down. This is going to be... <laughs> Jatina, oh no. Uh, this is going to be seven. There we go. Yeah, empty skill slots too. Yeah, this seems to be like a pretty good team right now. We need to make one more bed. A milestone. Cheers for everyone. Gin on me. <laughs> you rose. Thank you for the 29 months. Sweet baby Jesus. Thank you very, very much. All 
Alright, we can sleep through the night. Oh, god dang it. We got 246 wood over there, 106 stone. We need the oops. We need the stone to to make the oh the egg incubator. Yeah. Too close to another facility. Boom. Glad to be in the best community, loving all the content. Oh, Kage, thank you very, very much. Thank you to everybody for the support on this. Y'all have been absolutely amazing. We need a medicine workbench and a high-quality workbench. So we need to be level 12 for that next one. All right, we do have an egg. We have... I want to put the large verdant egg in there first. See what that is. 40 minutes. But I walked in to hear you talk about rehoming a cat. I need to know more. I'm not awake enough for that kind of tease. <laughs> well, as many of you know, I've been working on uh, uh, moving. So... I've been working on finding homes for the rescue kitties. And getting them a nice place to live. And uh, that's that's about it. All right, we don't need this bat anymore. We can dispose of that. Hey, Tag, you missed my last super chat. Just saying hi. I need some laughs today. Oh, kitty kill. I'm so sorry to hear that. Oh no. That is terrible. Well, hopefully we can give you some laughs. Staying in the current town? No, I'm gonna be... We're gonna be going into a cave. I wanna make sure I have food. We're gonna put this in storage because I can't make that yet. I don't know what that precious pelt is for. I wanna make sure that we have enough... I don't... I wanna be able to craft mega spheres. Oh, staying in current town? I don't know, man. I'm playing a video game. <laughs> We're doing video game things right now. Yeah, give me them balls. Ooh, and raw meat? What? Oh, look at the deer in the hot spring. Ooh. You deserve a pet. I can't. Wait, there's emotes? Oh, 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 whoa! Okay. Let's see here. Open this up. Yeah. I just threw another ball. God dang it. The deer is living your fantasy. Me too. Can you marry pals? What the hell? Who hurt you? All right, we got the high quality workbench. We need ingots. Oh, we need to actually start getting some good stuff in here. I only got four of those. I saw a metal node up here. There it is. Oh, Ginger. Oh, no. Look at you getting people addicted to new games, too. You can breed pals if you have male, a female, and a cake. <laughs> Perfect. I swear I just repaired this. CM, happy birthday. Was your name Basil Goose a couple days ago? Help. 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 
<laughs> Cake, you say? Yes. Making some good progress today. We don't know what the limitations are yet. Well, I'm sure that we do know what the limitations are because people have been playing it for days now, but... Alright, weapon is damaged. Let's just go ahead and craft these bad boys up. Oh, whoa. Oh, that's the Palgear workbench. Oh, Jesus! Requires kindling. How do I... Shoot. God dang it. Don't slap your stuff accidentally like me. Put your weapons away. All right, how? How do we make the ingots? Requires kindling. How How do get? What is kindling? I've never even seen it before. I know the fire says it needs kindling too, but that's not a thing I've ever seen anywhere. Other than wood. Fun game, yeah. The heck? Unknown item. Oh, unlocked after a certain pal is captured. Oh, you know what? Let's, um, I wonder if our fire pal is, um, is healed up. He is. Get to work, big boy. <laughs> Perfect. I just wanted to be able to access the inventory. I don't know why it wouldn't let me uh, do it, but I guess some things require pals no matter what, which is interesting. How much food do we have in here? We've got a decent amount of food. Disco. Disco's always slacking off. Are we even surprised at this point? No. No, we're not. Is there mod? The game isn't even out yet. No. Bad. <clears throat> All right, what else do we need to make? Oh, god dang it. I just threw a good ball. That stupid freaking button. Man, it pisses me off. Okay. They eat me or just fruits. They really eat anything, I think. I was really hoping this thing would help find, like... Wow, this finds a lot of good stuff. Did to repair your tools? Yeah, we, we just did. Right, we need one more. The deer looks like it's just headbanging. That deer is amazing. It's putting in the work, I'll tell you what. All right, for the high quality work, oh my God, we need 15. We've got four and we need nails too. 
All right. Well, we're going to do that later. Little teapot elephant can heal you. That's nice. Didn't I make a shield? Okay, I did equip it. All right, I think we're ready to, to try out the um, the cave. We'll go run into the cave real quick. See what it do. Oh, we don't need wood in here too. The ingots in there. Although, I just need to make more storage boxes, I think. You're in need of a penguin sacrifice? Look, I will kill more penguins if I have to. They'll be on the way, which is great. Alright, everybody's doing good work, except for Disco. Disco, you're kinda... You're kinda... You just need a nap, buddy. I think you'll be fine. Alright, to the caves! Going to the cave for the first time. For the very first time. Make a spear. The spear is worse than the bat we currently have. Figured out how to heal yet? Uh, you can eat. You can also pick up or get one of the elephants. Apparently they heal as well. All right, I've got 16, two big boys. To the caves, to the walls, to the foxtails drip down your bows. That would be very hot. Long while I'll be streaming today. We're going to do another... <laughs> I was supposed to stop already, but I want to go into this cave first. And then we're going to do another stream tonight so I can take a little bit of a break, eat some food. Enter dungeon. So ladies and gentlemen, if you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. Uh, we'll be playing plenty of Pal World. We'll also be hosting servers uh, that members will be able to play on. Oh, we've got humans in here. Oh, that's just, this is fun. Whoa. Whoa. Oh my god, why is there so many of them? I will freaking catch you. You want to be a friend? I don't even care if it's inhumane. Get in the ball. You want to go, bro? You're dead. Catch the humans. Oh, I'm going to catch one. They're pissing me off. Are you still alive? Why are you wiggling so much? I want to touch the glowy mushrooms. You can actually catch people. It's considered inhumane though. The real question is, can I breed a human with a pal? We're going to find out. We're going to find out in the next stream. I'll tell you what. All right. Get in the ball. Be a good boy. This is what you get for being a thug. Oh, you think you're cool? Oh, you're dead. God dang it, Fireboy. Why are you like this? What? It's for science. How? Why am I bad? Are we all about science around here? This feels like a little boss arena. Oh, what are you? You little drifty boy, huh? A Kilimari. Capture rate, 9%? Ah, shoot. What's in here? We got some uh, thugs, another chance to 
to catch one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, I'm gonna use the good Pokeball on it. 17%. 48. Oh, God dang it. We need better balls. Ooh, this has a lot of Palladium Fragments in it. Very nice. The balls are too weak. Sometimes it'd be like that. What level tech is the next tier of balls? Level 14. We get a crossbow and machine gun before we get the better balls. Well, ain't that crazy. Okay, go to the other side. Which balls do I have equipped? I've got 16 of these left. Look, we're gonna clump some more humans. Hopefully we catch one. It's for science. Oh. Well, what are you? A um, wow. Oh shoot. These things are only level five. Let's put a uh, little fire boy back. Try and catch a couple of these. Yeah. It's got a little bottle opener tail. Yeah, we're gonna use it for the bar. I bet it's really good for the bar, actually. Because we can make a bar, for those of you that don't know. Oh, which, what you think you're doing? Oh, mud slapping me? Get in the ball. <laughs> it's hard tail doesn't deteriorate even when cut off. Some believe these severed tails to be good luck. But for the <laughs> who post as a result, they were anything but. Oh boy. That's unfortunate. What is this? Ooh, sulfur. That's new. Oh, I'm thick. God dang it. Oh, we're just gonna have to drop this wood. We got plenty of wood back at base. Should have put it in storage. Should have made a storage box with it while we were there. Is the game good? I've been really enjoying it. Been very, very much enjoying it actually. How big is this cave? I think the caves are actually pretty big, huh? Yeah. Oh, 
Get in the ball. Get in the ball. Whoops. Look. You get in the ball. You be a good human. And maybe I'll give you some snacks later. I said... Oops. I got excited. God dang it. They also just announced new raid bosses for Friday. Dang. Nice. It definitely looks like they got good plans for the game, honestly. It's pretty exciting to see. And how do I get out of here? There's a boss at the end of this cave, too. So many good resources as well. I don't know what the sulfur is used for, but it's the only place I've seen it so far. I don't see any boss back here. I think this is the end of this little area. Some more thugs over there. Bow, bow, bow. Um, but I think we are going to stop here for now. We've been streaming for three hours. I didn't plan on streaming for this long. Uh, but obviously I am enjoying the game. We will be back very soon uh, streaming more of uh, of Pal World. I'm very, very excited for this. We'll be playing this a lot over the next couple days. Definitely expect videos out as well for this. Uh, let's try and catch one of these humans before we uh, before we stop. I think maybe what happens is if we... We get them really close to death and then continuously hit them with the Pokeballs. That it should get better. I just want to catch one. Oh, you suck. You're so close to dead. Just get in the get in the sphere. There we go. We'll keep doing this. I got all day, buddy. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay, we'll use our last big ball. Come on. Oh, what? Oh, and you snuck up there? All right, ladies and gentlemen, we will be back very soon playing more Pal World. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, show the video some love. Definitely keep an eye out for more content and live streams, and hopefully I'll see you all in the next one.